If you are watching this, please do comment, like, subscribe, join the notification gang, hit the notification bell, get notifications every and any time I post. Thank you, I appreciate it, and I'm out. What is up, YouTube? It is showtime, and I am back at the end of the video. For today's video, um, we're going to be going over the best badge method um, in NBA 2K21 Next Gen. But before we get into anything, um, yesterday we had a really lit stream. We had around an overall of 1,800 views. Um, there was a point we were at around 72 viewers. So it was really nice to see how everyone come together, be positive, have a good time in stream. I'm um, hoping you do more streams like that, but if you are new to the channel, uh, welcome to the channel, welcome to my content. I hope you like what I do, enjoy my content, and we'll get straight on to today's video. So in today's video, guys, I will be showing you the best and fastest badge method so you guys can max out your badges as soon as possible and probably in under 24 hours. Um, this is a really good method that 2K has added. It's not a glitch or anything. All it is is a method that 2K has, uh, an opportunity 2K has given us all to get double badge points. So for those of you who, don't, who do not have next gen, there is now a feature in the game called the warehouse. Now how you do, well, how you go about getting into the warehouse and um, all this good stuff is you actually have to watch Walk around the park and find somebody who will give you a warehouse challenge and during these challenges you get double batch points the whole entire game um, so the city is pretty big so in this tutorial video I will be showing you where you can find each and every person and their location in order for you to get your challenges done as soon as possible so you're not just wandering around the city I should say not the neighborhood the city are uh, trying to find these people and to get your challenges done as fast as possible so as you guys can see here, I'm currently in the city right now and uh, something that not a lot of people are aware of, you, you have a journal that ends up tracking all the active uh, objectives that you have right now. So what you do is you wanna press the options button on your controller, you go to the city, and here you see the 2K journal. Now here is all your challenges. I've completed all 24 and was able to get a lot of badges doing this. Um, your reward is you get a Warehouse King Pirate hat, which I don't really like, but it's a free hat that you get. Um, so here you guys have it. You guys have all the people. You have Jerome, Jeremiah, and Grace, Allison. All these people will give you individual challenges. And once you complete all, um, you will get the hat. But through each challenge that you do, each and every one, you will get double uh, badge points through each of them. So I'm going to show you the location of each of these people because, as you guys can know, it can be very difficult to find where each person is um, and trying to locate them to try and actually get their challenges. Now next, if you're looking for Allison, who is also on the 2K Journal, she'll be right around in this area near the City Hall Western Wildcats. If you just skateboard these blocks or walk these blocks, you will definitely see her. She'll be walking around this uh, area and you'll be able to find her and get your uh, other warehouse challenge. So if you're looking for Billy, Billy is actually right between the north side uh, Knights and the Western Wildcats. Right around this building, you will find Billy. So if you spin this block a few times, you'll end up running into Billy for his warehouse uh, double badge points challenges. Then if you're looking for Hannah, who is also in your 2K Journal for Warehouse Challenges, she'll be right around here specifically. Um, she'll be right around this area, this neighborhood, this block, and you will end up finding her for her challenges. Then right around here, you'll end up finding Ava, who is around the 24 Kobe Mural Court. Um, she'll be spinning this around this area, uh, walking around this area. You should find her right around the 24 Mural Court. You will find Ava. Last, you will find right around the Beast of the East Store area, you will find Jake. Uh, he is the last warehouse challenge member that you will have to find. He is right around this building and the Beast of the East Store affiliation merch store. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. I hope it was useful and helpful to those trying to complete all 24 of their warehouse challenges. If you did like the video, just leave a like. If you like what I'm doing, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. Get notifications any and every time I leave a post. Uh, once again, thank you guys for viewing the video. I appreciate it. 2,000 subscribers on the way. And I'm out.